My uh, disclosures have not changed. So Tuesday's procedures are the gold standard, but they're significant associated morbidity and mortality, and they're costly to the patient and the healthcare system. So if you can save the uh, if you can save the implant, I think you should try whenever indicated. Not all infected cases are the same, but the principles of treatment are the same. So you know what DARE stands for, debridement, antibiotics, implant, and retention. So when should we dare to dare? There's been a lot of pessimism around these procedures in the past, you know, with basically people saying that they don't work, maybe the success rate is only about 50%, because historically there have been papers showing that uh, the success rate was highly dependent on um, uh, the antimicrobials, uh, you could potentially have worse results associated uh, eventually with prior DARE procedures, and salvage was very unlikely past 28 days. But more recent paper shows that even though obviously there's higher rates of failure compared to two stages in the DARE group, and lower function, uh, there was, low, uh, there was uh, higher rates of wound complications as a group, when you kind of parceled out, uh, depending on host and uh, uh, mi uh, microbials, uh, the rates uh, can significantly improve if you are selective about these patients. So I like to talk about when to perform DARE. This is, uh, this is Simon Young's data from uh, New Zealand showing that their overall DARE success rate is about uh, two-thirds of the patient, which is in line with all the other papers. But then, you know, if those that fa failed DARE, which is about a third of the patients subsequently underwent two-stage procedures, they didn't necessarily suffer any worse outcomes compared to going uh, initially. So for the 47-year-old attorney, six weeks status was primary total hip arthroplasty with leaking wound. I think if the patient is a good host, has a non-resisting organism, and the symptoms have been less than three weeks of, uh, of duration, I think you could potentially try it. So you have to be selective. This is the consensus from the... Um,